So, Mark, this is the end of the story here in uh, Portolos, and uh, it was a great story for Workano. You are the winner along uh, with your crew. What's your feeling about the event here in Portolos? I think it was definitely a very happy ending. Um, the, the race committee, the jury, the, the you know, all the, the uh, volunteers, everyone did a fantastic job. A um, little worried that they weren't going to get an event off because the, the wind was pretty late, but every day we got three races in and there were three good races. And, and uh, a little tricky out there, a little light, a little shifty, but we were able to make our way through and, and came out on top, so we're pretty happy. You were really, really consistent during all the event. And what about the secret of your success here in Portos? I think, um, you know, just kind of keeping it calm on the boat and um, uh, trying to stay out of trouble, you know, not really pushing ourselves into situations, uh, staying good angle of heel, good trim, good crew movements, you know, crisp maneuvers. Uh, you know, we didn't make too many mistakes. It's, you know, we're trying to minimize the mistakes out there and just everybody does their job. If I made no mistake, I think that the next event for you, it will be the Worlds in uh, Canada. Yes. So you will arrive as the winner of uh, the second event of the European Sailing Series. Do you think that uh, it can be some that give you some uh, more power on the water? Maybe a little momentum. We've had a pretty good um, year so far. Miami, I wasn't with them in Miami, but they took third. And then we just recently, oh, I'm sorry, they took second. We took third in Charleston a couple weeks ago. We just won this event, so we're coming off of podium finishes. Um, we've got three weeks off now, and then we're going to hit it again. We'll probably have about a week practice before the Worlds and the pre-Worlds. So we're just going to keep trying to get better, you know, make, make improvements. And last but not least, uh, what about the, different, the differences between European fleet and the U.S. fleet? Uh, I think both are very competitive. Um, this is only my second event here in Europe, but uh, I mean, everybody's great. Everybody came up and congratulated us and they're very happy, very friendly. Um, we had a great time, just fantastic. Porter Rose was awesome.